G'day, I'm Mark Berg and welcome to another week of Fishing Addiction, the show that surprises fishers all over Australia with incredible fishing adventures. This week we're in a place called Magundua, which is about two hours south of Adelaide in South Australia. We're about to surprise a dairy farmer called Cain. He, his farm's just down the road here. He has no idea we're coming. We're going to rock up in this D-Max and give him the surprise of his life. We are fishing with offshore boats charters in the Northern Territory, just out of Darwin. These guys really know what they're doing, taking us two days on the reef, a couple of days chasing barra. Kane is gonna have the time of his life. Let's go get him. Just met up with Ash, who you'll meet in a second, and that's Kane's uh, partner. We're following her in right now. She's going to take us right in. Now, apparently, he's on a tractor somewhere on the property, so we don't even know where he is. But we're going to follow her in, and then she's going to jump in the car with us, and we're going to go looking for him around the farm. He's here somewhere. Oh, I've got a feeling as soon as he sees the D Max, he might know, know that it's us coming. Sounds good. If you get bogged, I'll bring out a track. Oh, okay. If I get bogged, they're going to bring in a track. I don't think I'll get bogged in the D-Max. I'm so excited. <laughs> I have not been out. Of, I've been out since four. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, this is Ash. This is Kane's partner. And we're going to go find him now. So we we put the uh, D-Max in four wheel drive because it's a bit boggy apparently. You can see him. Yeah, he's on that tractor right where, there. Where are we went? Just straight out there, straight in front. Oh, right at the, the back there. Thing. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> I reckon he's got an idea. <laughs> Look at him, yes! <laughs> Let's go and meet the man. How did you know? I saw you on Instagram coming to Adelaide and I just... Had a feeling? I had a feeling. How are you, brother? The city good, mate. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Oh my god, I can't <laughs> believe it. And everyone's been acting so bloody weird too. That's what it's been. <laughs> You've been really weird with your feet. Come over here. Come over here. Bare feet in yeah. the paddock. Oh my god. Oh. Thank you. I can't believe it. No, stay in there. Stay oh, in there. Right. So uh, yeah, we obviously know what's happening. I'm going fishing. You're going fishing, mate. The crazy thing about this oh is that. We actually tried to do this a few times, yeah. <laughs> but because of COVID, like we booked flights and we had to cancel it. Oh. So this poor girl <laughs> has, I mean, how long has it been going for now? It's been Since a few months. November. November. Oh, you kept that for Months me. and months. We were watching you the other day and she's like, oh, it's great. We're getting the pack and everything. I'm like, oh, maybe one day I'll get to go fishing. <laughs> oh, my well done for keeping a good secret. Oh, it was bloody hard, I tell you what, oh. restless night. So. And then this morning she said she was up at four, yeah. like yeah. just thinking and... Overexcited this morning at four o'clock and yeah. I was waking up to milk the cows. I thought, like, well, what is she awake for? <laughs> it's oh, really not that exciting milking the cows <laughs> no, all of a sudden. I, I was like pumped. All right, so let's get into it, mate. Uh, well, we're obviously here to take you fishing, but you don't yeah. know where we're going, what no, we're doing. I do so not. we are tomorrow morning. We're taking you to the Northern Territory. Oh my God! Have you ever caught a barramundi? No. You're about to. Uh, we're fishing with these really good guys. They're called offshore boats charters, and they yeah. get this massive stabby. It's got a 300 horsepower on it, so we're just going to be tearing all over the Northern Territory. We're going to do a couple of days of blue water fishing. Yeah. And then we're going to do a couple of days of barra runoff Unreal. fishing, and they've been getting some absolute stonkers. Yeah, how's that feel? Oh, that's unbelievable, mate. Thank you so much. Yeah? I, just, I can't believe it. Like, like I said, when I seen that, you are in Adelaide, and when I seen the orange you, <laughs> and everyone's been acting so weird, and it all, add up, it all adds up now. I just, yeah. And then, of course, on top of that, I mean, you've already won, but yeah. you've got the Fishing Addiction Challenge as yeah. well. Yeah. $5,000 worth of gear from our very good friends at Wilson Fishing Australia. Yeah. 
and then you've got another 2,000 bucks worth of gear from Attic Tackle, my tackle store. Um, and we'll set the challenge when we get there. But yeah. that's seven grand's worth of fishing oh gear. God, I don't know, what else. I don't know if you need it though, you only catch carp here, don't you? Yeah, that's it, that's all we need. So a few cans of corn and something, and a few new hooks and I'll be set, so. What else do you go fishing for though, normally? Oh, I usually just squid, whiting, that's about it. Like, bit my biggest fish would be a 75 centimetre mile away, probably, so. Oh my yeah, gosh, that yeah. is about to change. Yeah. Big time. Big oh time. my god. Big time, big time. God almighty, it's been so hard. Like, Kane is the hardest person to keep a surprise from. Like, any slight bit of difference in your day to day, and he's onto it. So, I tell you what, I feel like Mark's given me a hard task, but I'm bloody, bloody happy that he has. So, yeah, so, so excited. And Oh, well, I seen you coming a bit beforehand, and I was just like, oh, it's, it, 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 it's happening. Like, it actually is happening. And then I seen you get out and I'm just like, now I just don't even know what to say. I'm just lost for words. And then my first thing was like, I wonder where we're going. <laughs> I wasn't thinking, oh my God, it's happening. I was more thinking, I wonder what we're doing, where we're going. And then you told me we're heading up to the NT and yeah, I couldn't be more stoked that we're heading there. It's always been on the bucket list. This one's a voice trip. That's right, I can thank that in my... Um, yeah, I'll owe you, you a few after this, I reckon. Yeah, mate, brandy might. points for life, my yeah, friend. Yeah. Welcome to the show, my friend. Thanks, mate. Unreal. Cheers. Oh, God. It's just so it. good. It feels so good. It is so good. This is the suspension in that thing, Widget. Yeah, nice. Alright, we'll follow you guys. So Kane and fishing, oh, honestly, it's like a match made in heaven. Whenever he's around fishing, seeing fishing, anything to do with boats, what, whatever, he just loves it. And I think it's one of those things when you're working on a family farm and it's demanding hours and quite physical hard labour, just to be able to get on that water and really just focus in on that and yeah, just, just enjoy yourself. I think that's what Kane really loves. <laughs> Did you, you didn't know it. I never win. And you've got a great name too. Mark. How you going, mate? I'm Mark as well. Marky Mark. Yeah. It's Marky Mark and the Funky Bunch. How are you, mate? Now, we spoke on the phone, didn't we? Well, guys, thanks for showing us around the farm. It's been really, really cool. Uh, congratulations and welcome thanks, to the show. Mate. Hey, shush. <laughs> Try and do a show here. Um, I'm going to jump in the D-Max. I'm going to head back into Adelaide. Yeah. We will meet you at the airport bright and early tomorrow. Yep, sounds good. Our adventure starts then, up to Darwin, away we go. Beautiful, Ash, mate. thank you so much. Give us a little no, one. Thank you. All right, mate, I'll see you Thanks, in the morning, mate. Brilliant, yeah. cheers. See you guys. Oh, oh my God. God. I can't believe it. Mwah. Yeah, we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh. So on this trip, we're doing things a little bit differently. We're actually basing ourselves here in uh, the middle of Darwin, so in the Magnum Apartments and Jordan and his team from Offshore Boats Fishing Charters, they're actually going to come to the centre of town and pick us up every morning. And we go off on an adventure through Darwin Harbour and all the way, all over the place in their massive big stabby with the 300 horsepower on the back of it. Which is kind of cool because when we come back at night we can go to the restaurants, we can take in all of Darwin City which is pretty cool. So. How you going? Kane. This is Kane, our winner. Hey, hey Kane. Kane. Mate, Kane. You're the best adventure, mate. Kane, the dairy farmer, pumped to catch a big fish. Yeah, yeah you go. did it. Ready to go. John and Jordan are our guides for the week. Collectively, these two blokes have countless hours of experience on the water around Darwin. And today, they are itching to show us the potential that lies just a few miles from the city. Well, Kane, welcome to the Northern Territory, mate. Cheers, mate. Thank you. First drop, we're bait fishing, mate. We don't do a lot of bait fishing, yep. but I'm actually really looking forward to it. Dropping yep. a bit of a squid down or a fish bait. Fish bait yeah. And uh, these guys reckon there's a few black jewfish here. So you might get your PB fish in your first drop. Yeah, that'd be pretty exciting, I think. <laughs> and then we're going to talk about the fishing addiction challenge, my friend. Yeah, yeah. So let's start fishing and we'll just see what unfolds, yeah? No worries, mate. That's let's side, go. This side, let's go. You're not allowed to catch a bigger fish than me, that's the rule. <laughs> Let's go outside. Yep. Oh, yes! Oh, so can't get it. Oh, 
Nice one, Kane. Get a wind on him, son. There you go. No, it's not a jewelry, but it's a fish. It is a fish. Oh, the boy can angle. I like it. Oh, no. Don't record. <laughs> what have you got, mate? Oh, there's a groper down there. See that? Oh, my Big God. Big Queensland groper came up for that bat fish. Trying to eat it. Let it go down. Let yeah, it go let it go down. Oh. Yeah, he's chasing it. He's chasing it. He's chasing it. Oh! He's, he's got it. He's just bailed the bat. He's got it. Oh, no! <laughs> hey, really? Woo! Oh, big groper. Now you're in trouble, son. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Get a wind on him. Yeah, we'll see him in about half an hour. <laughs> Told you, PB in your first 10 minutes, but... Oh, it's done him. Oh, no! Could not even... Could not... Yeah, that's a, that's a better thing. Yes. Whoa, it's a bit of line. Now we're talking. Moving up to the heifer. Yeah, that feels a lot better. Oh, right here, what we got? Grassy. Ah, nice fish. Now that's Beautiful. a very credible fish. There's nothing wrong with that. This is a very lucky fish. They're good eating, but it's going to go back. He doesn't. He's not suffering from barotrauma. So yep. all you got to do is put your finger in that, open yep. it up, spear him in. No worries. See you, buddy. See you, mate. That's one lucky little grassy. All right, you've caught one. Let's set the fishing addiction challenge, my friend. Yeah. Five thousand dollars worth of gear from our very good friends at Wilson Australia Fishing. Yeah. And two grand's worth of gear from AddictTackle.com.au. Seven thousand bucks worth of gear on the line. Yeah, ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. All right, this is what you've got to do. Ten different species of fish. Yep. You've just caught one. Yep. All right, yep. so you only got nine to go. Yep. Ten different species of fish. Because we're fishing two days reef, yep. and then we're going to go two days barra. Yep. you got to get a barra over a metre as well. Yeah, no, I know. No. But yeah. it's the runoff. Yeah. The boys, they, they've been getting them. Yeah. All right, so them. ten species. Now, the barra's not included in those ten species. Yep. Ten species plus a barra so. over a and you've got to remember this, even if we don't get the 10 species over the next two days, yeah, yeah. in the estuaries there's heaps of um, yep. species in there as yep. well. Yep. No, you up no, for it? Yeah, definitely, mate. Yeah, Can you imagine sure. if we if you, like, catch a metery, oh, how awesome that would be? Fish of a lifetime, like you say. And Ooh. there is a little bit of a twist. Yep. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. If I get a barrow over a metre, we're going to count it as well. Oh, unreal. Hey? Yeah, that would be bloody awesome. All two, right. sets of, two sets going at it. So That'd be so good. good. Yeah. Challenge is set. Challenge is accepted. Good luck, my friend. Cheers, mate. Slimy, slimy shake. Slime shake. Your favourite. Let's go fishing. Hey, guys. If you want to support Fishing Addiction, become a member today. Uh, we really try and make dreams come true on this show, and uh, with all your support, we, uh, we can do it. But the more members we have, the more trips we can do, the bigger prizes we can give away. So become part of the crew today. Sign up at fishingaddiction.com.au. Uh, and you never know, it could be your door that I come knocking on next. That could be. Oh, that's a fish. That's oh. a fish. Gone. Oh. That's a juke. Get up. <laughs> no, we're going to try not to. Gotta get him off that reef. Come on, buddy. Up. I think I got him. I think I got him. Oh, so it hasn't taken too long, and my bait's been smashed yet again. And I tell you, I'd say this is a very nice jewfish. Oh. Very, very good jew. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Having a good old yeah, thump. Look at that, that thump. 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 <laughs> there he is. Nice good fish. Right, I'm going to step back as it comes up. It's not a monster, but he's a lovely fish. And really accounted well for himself. Oh, nice dude. Oh, beautiful. Yes. That's what we've been looking for. 
Yeah. Good fish, Bergie. Good yeah. fish to start the day. Beautiful. Yeah, beauty. Now these fish do suffer from barotrauma pretty bad and we're fishing in about 20 odd metres of water. So he won't survive if we let him go. So we'll get some great fillets off this, bring him back into town tonight, get a restaurant cook him up for us. So we'll get him on ice now. Beautiful fish. A little cocktail happening here. This is the winning formula. Look at that. If I was a fish, I would totally eat that. Yummy. Let's give it a go. Got a bite, mate? Yeah, I'm getting bites for sure. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Get into him. You got a good fish there, bro. Yes, get it up. Yes, Kane. That's baby. better. That's what we've come for. Yes. Go, son. Yeah, that definitely feels a lot better. Yes. Hopefully oh, another species for like it. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. We're getting close now, eh? Yeah. That belly. <laughs> Oh, hang on a second, hang on a second, hang on a second. How big is it though? Oh, it's big enough. Hey. Golden Trevally. Oh, whoa, whoa, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. I'm on. Here we go, boys. Oh. Yeah, we found some fish. I've got okay. Sweet, another one, guys. Beautiful. Another one there. Second species, is it Bergy? What did you say before about a carp or something? Oh, I said I had lips like a carp. But... How dare you compare a golden trevally to a stinky carp? Yeah, well, that, when, that's all you catch all your life, you get used to Look it. Look at the lips on this guy, mate. Like, they, they put... Oh, I can't get them out now, but they suck right out. Yeah. Look at that. Unreal, isn't it? Cool fish there. That's definitely another... Beautiful. Another one to tick off the list, my friend. Let's see what you've got there, then, mate. Eh? Well, probably something better. Yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> hey, don't like that. that. Uh, I've got a shark! <laughs> I've got a shark, I eat my words. What's that one? Shark. Sharks! <laughs> oh man. Alright, I think you need to get that fish back in the water. Yep. That's a real one. Get him up. There we go. Come on, baby. Keep that hook in its mouth. Whee. You got him, Kane. You got him, mate. You right to know that one, John? Come on, baby. Whee. Just bring that rod to your eyebrows, no higher. Yep. Hey! There we go! There we go! Wicked! That's awesome! Well done! Thanks, oh, mate! Top the 75, baby! You reckon? We'll go close, oh, I reckon! Oh, I reckon definitely! Yeah, beautiful! I reckon that's about 85, 90, that one! Sick! That's awesome! And that's another species, mate! Well yeah, done! Yeah, brilliant! Well done! Thanks, guys! Congratulations! Woohoo! Broken! Cool fish! Nice fish, really Listen good fish! It. Yeah, yeah. Sounded like you last night. Oh! <laughs> no, that's a great fish. Just stoked. Three already. Yeah. Keep it going. Come on. There he is. <laughs> Trevally. What have we got there? Pine of Oh, it's a tea leaf, is it? Could be some bait on this one. Yeah, look. You gotta give me that, come on. <laughs> I ain't gotta give you nothing, you likes. <laughs> nothing. We're not giving this away. The boys are trying to help me, but it's not happening. Nah. Let's have a look. Yeah, man, Let's have a closer little look. Little tea leaf trevally. Yeah, tea leaf trevally. You can see why they call them tea leaf trevally, folks. You can see all those little black dots all over them just look like tea leaves. And a lot of guys mistaken these for um, 
the GTs as well. And you can see that lateral line and these are really unusual as well. This guy sort of goes up and then down yeah, and then across his back. Cool little fish. Very cool. And uh, <laughs> I think we'll count that, mate. Oh, brilliant. I think that's fair enough. Awesome. No, that's great. The amount of fish you've lost today, I think we're going to have to help oh. you out. Mate, <laughs> that hasn't been angler error, though, I don't oh, think. Oh, well, has it? I don't know. How oh. many is that? Is that four? That's four, yeah. Four? Four. four. Jeez, we've got to be quick, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> slow it down a bit, you reckon? Yeah, slow it down a bit. Well done. They're no good to eat. They don't suffer from barotrauma so much, so this guy can go back in. All right, Ready. So. Off we go. Cheers, mate. And a shower. Brilliant. Oh, good girl. Yeah, fishing for me is just a, a release, like, I love what what I do here on the farm, and I love the family the family business. But just an an outlet, other than obviously I have my footy and my mates and stuff. But just I, I seem to enjoy nothing more than when I'm fishing and when I'm out. And hopefully new new species. Come on, baby. <laughs> oh, it's a baddie. You said you were going to count that earlier. I I did too, didn't I? Yeah, I did say I'd count a bad fish. I mean, look at it. They're pretty cool fish. They are the very old, cool. The old dinner plate fish. I don't I don't think I can begrudge him now. I'm going to count that. Well, that's quite good then. Yeah, that's if good it was me. a caddy or a shark, nah. But look at that thing. They're crazy fish. They are. The old batty, hey? Oh, bites. Bites, lots of bites. I'm five. this be? What is it? What is it? Oh, hey. nice golden snapper. That's the one we're after. Lift her in, mate. Yes. Hey. Yeah. That's Beautiful. the one we've been looking for. That's a lovely fish. Yeah, not Weekend. quite big enough, but you know, no, just kidding. <laughs> She's an upgrade from the last only one. Only just, only though they get like a lot bigger than that, yeah. my friend, but that's still a we great cannot fish. not count it, yeah. that's right, still a lovely fish. No, no, I'm stoked with that, lads. That yeah. is definitely one that I wanted to catch when I come up here. So good. An upgrade would be nice. I reckon Bergie's about to get one right I'm now. Just getting a lot of hat wax, I can tell you that. We decided to pull anchor and change techniques. Now it's time to try some jigging and spinning for pelagics. There we go. There we go. Whoa. Good fish. Yes. Have you got any drag there? Don't lose him. Here he comes. Is it a calf or a heifer? No, we'll call it a heifer. Oh, yeah, it's a brassy. Yep. Beautiful. Bloody oh. Well Here we done. Go. Nice. nice. Now, I've got to say, I don't think I'm going to count that. No, I mean it. I don't think I'm going to count it. For a brassy trevally, that's pretty small. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> like, you don't count with an oil terrier to catch a three kilo, four kilo brassy. No, boys, I'm being serious. What do you reckon? <laughs> well, yeah, I, I, I don't but know, but... You did count a bad fish. Nah. <laughs> yeah, but that's that's different. It's a rare cat. Nah, I'm not counting it. Righto, mate. Turn it home. You're the boss. Too Ready small. Home. Too small. Come on. Oh, fish on. Shot. There we go. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Somebody's head, you think it might be a no, Trevor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trevor? Trevor? Is it a better one? Uh, if I'm pulling it, yes. Oh, yours. Oh, it's heaps bigger. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. There's all this a kilo bigger, at least. screaming, carrying on. No, I get it. You're playing a good try, boys. A small one. Oh, it's about hooked, too. Yeah, nah. They're harder to catch that one. Nah. 
I did it again. I hope the GT is a green fish dry. Okay, man. Ah. No, 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 no. No. No, 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 no. Titan drag. No. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's good. That's getting him out of there. There he is sounding away as they do, thump, thump, thump. Nice little brassy. Often his mates will follow him up, not this time. Oh, he swallowed the whole thing. So that's a bit better. That, that one I'd count. Oh, you haven't got me like that much. Oh, oh mate, that's, that's at least an inch and a half longer. Okay. Look at that. Well, that's day one, done and dusted, mate. Did you have a good time? Yeah, awesome day, mate. It's been full on, a little bit slow to start with, but once we got onto them, we were... Well, yeah. slow for you, it wasn't slow for me. <laughs> I think I caught you midday, I what reckon. Are, what are you reckon, five, what are you up to, five species? Six. You sure? Yeah. Better yeah. watch this bloke, I tell you. Yeah, nah. six species out yeah. of your ten that you need, yeah. and then, of course, we've still got a few more days after that yeah. for Barra. So we've still got a lot of fishing to do, mate. Yep. But right now, it's time to scoot all the way back to the boat ramp. And that's one of the great things about fishing with these guys, is we actually get to go back into town and maybe get some Indian for Yeah, that. sounds good. Sound all right? Yeah, a couple of cold ones. Righto, boys, take us home. Beer o'clock. Good day, eh? Yep. So this is day two, fishing in the territory with the guys from Offshore Boats. And this morning we're gonna chase some barra. Now, we've come to a coastal creek and we're just waiting for that tide to change. You can see the color of the water here, very tannin stained. And when, with the runoff, what basically happens is the floodplains, they fill with water from all the rain. That water fills up those billabongs, big barra, they come out and they need to come into salt water to spawn. So you get, obviously get these big female barramundi coming down these creeks when the tide's running out. So like three or four other boats that are here, we're anchored, we're on the uh, Minn Kota, we're on the spot lock, and we're just gonna be casting and casting and casting. Now this style of fishing, you don't see a lot of fish. You're not sitting there catching small ones all day long, or casting snags, you're sort of casting open water but this is where you catch your big girls. And obviously part of Kane's challenge, 5,000 bucks worth of gear from Wilson and, and a couple of from Attic Tackle, seven grand's worth of gear on the line. Part of his challenge is to catch a metre barra. So that's why we're sort of gonna give this a rock, rock over the next few days, just this repetitive casting in these creek mouths as that tide starts to push out. Hopefully we'll find us that metre barra, that dream fish that we all wanna catch. A lot of casts to come, I'd say. On? Yep. Fish on. Yeah, a little thready. Go on, Greg. That's it. Let's get him in. <laughs> well, 
Oh, come on. <laughs> well, new species. Come on. Seriously. The boys are on my side. All right, hang on. Boys, what do you think? Can we count it? Yeah, I think so. That's really? A great, that's a great oh, size, Freddy. That. Yeah, that's a nice eating size. Yeah, perfect eating size. What do you guys reckon? That's a keeper. Can you count as a species on the list or what? Yeah, I reckon. Really? Oh, <laughs> far out. All right, OK. Oh, beautiful. Fine, we'll count it. <laughs> Number seven. Perfect. So that's... Oh. Come on, mate. That's soft, mate. Catch that barrel for me too, can you? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> that's so soft. Uh, I'm going to change the rules. Yep. Why oh, Johnson's bigger than that thing? Seven down. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers, lads. One nil, isn't it? That was crap. <laughs>
Woohoo! That was awesome. That's a good brassy. Brilliant. Hey. Oh, cracker. What a ripper. That's got to be the best one. Yep. Got to be. It's a beautiful fish. That first run, how good was that? Yeah, they just take off like a rocket. Sizzling. Very nice fish. Beautiful. Thanks, guys. Put us right on How them. crazy is this? You are on a paddock a couple of days ago. <laughs> I know. A tractor. I would be literally working today. On, on sad days I work and I'd be working. I'd be either bloody doing something with the cows or now I'm here and in the NT doing this. It's crazy. That's what dreams are made of, to be honest. Oh, we'll do the flip and off he goes. Having a shower on the way. So there it goes. is time. Yeah, look at him. Yeah, and down he goes. It's time now. Find a mackerel. Yeah. Mackie time. Yeah. Hey! Got oh, he's gone! Got him? <laughs> got him. That's a mackerel. Ah! Oh. oh no, keep going. Oh, yeah, still there. Still there. Hey, still got him. Yo, young cane. Oh, Let him run. Babe. That was that for a cycle. That guy. was awesome. <laughs> awesome. Did Loft, did Loft get that? Oh, <laughs> that was cool. Was Actually, fun. see, I'm pretty sure it was a mackerel smashing bait. Saw its back of its tail come out of the water. Kane's cut. We both cast to it, and it's just going to smash Kane's lure. That is cool. Hopefully, it is a mackerel that we uh, first thought it was. Oh, that's a good run up there. Unreal. That was crazy. One of the best takes I've ever seen. Come on, number nine. I can see it. I did see it come out, yep. It is a GT. Yeah, GT's a, a brassy. Speed. Mackie. Yep. Another speed. Oh, 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 shark on it, quick. Squeak it up. Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh no. No. <laughs> no. Shark. <laughs> no. Sharks. Oh, no. oh. Do I just snap it off or what? <laughs> oh, no. Bummer. Stupid sharks. And gone. Gone oh. right here. So close, Kano. So oh. close, mate. God. That's all right. We'll get another one. Okay. What do you even say, mate? What do you say? You just you go like this, don't you? And go, you say, sharks. Sharks. <laughs> <laughs> Two of them, too. Yeah, oh, yeah. They, mate, often that'll happen and you'll be on it. They love mackerel for yeah. one, but yeah. you'll be on a fish and you will literally get a pack of five, ten, yeah. even more sharks. Yeah. And it's just over in seconds. Yeah. Well, folks, that's the end of part one of our adventure here with offshore boats fishing charters in the magnificent Northern Territory. Let's take a quick look at what's in store for you next week. Don't stop leaving, I'll come out and drop the shark. Oh, oh, get him away from the shark! Yes! Yeah. <laughs> that's a barra, people. Metre 14. Step in, step in. Oh, that's a metre. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you made this! <laughs> oh. yes. Good work! <laughs> well, that's all next week on Fishing Addiction. Now, remember to give yourself the chance to come on the show. Just like Kane, you've got to be a Fishing Addiction member. So go to the website, fishingaddiction.com.au. Sign up today and you never know just like those people hollering over in the background there, catching their big barra, it could be you. Sign up today. I'm Mark Berg, you stay safe, and God bless. <laughs>